Ah, uh, hey, sorry about that. Um, I have folks coming in and um, just had to make sure that everything was cleared out. But yeah, uh, but for some reason I'm also getting a heart, any heart, uh, some form of heart themed outfit. So a heart armor and let's see if I can actually get it. Or if I end up buying a banana, no. Okay, we got the armor. So, uh, I'm trying to think what color I should be. Hmm. Dear God. <laughs> um. I'ma do cream. Let's do this cream color. Or some sort. And Chris gets to get the heart spear. Interesting, a heart is like the theme of the episode. Who knows? There we go. So, uh... Let's keep going. It seems like we didn't get all the treasure. Um... Let's fix that. Let's definitely fix that. Looks like we're, we're getting to a really fast pace with this. Okay. Let's keep it going. Hmm. Spin Slash should do the trick. Don't be dumb. Damn it, Todd. Aw, at least Cairo's giving you food. I guess that bell can do many things. <laughs> uh. Ooh, ow. My arm is actually pretty sore, so I'm trying to, like, not do super hefty activity. Um, I actually went to the, um, the supermarket earlier, and I had to carry um, some bags, and it was really, like, really heavy and shit. Oh, something for Gerald. That's pretty dope. Uh, his shoulders are exposed. Ooh. Let's do that. That pretty much matches up your weapon. We need to go up to get this latch, this last treasure. Okay. Hmm. Let's snort these fuckers. Nice. I am smart. I am very smart. Oh shit, Ty is on a verge of death. Oh wow. <laughs> yeah, Todd was on a verge of death. That's like, that's crazy shit. Didn't have to do much. Um, just do a regular attack, and that should be it. There you go. Uh, I've cooked a few things. 
Um, I like to make sandwiches. Um, I I love I like to make cauliflower rice. I've cooked that before with some shrimp. I've I've cooked a, a couple of other things. Um. A lot of times, like, as a, as a college student, um, you're barely even have time to really cook for yourself. Um, so you basically, like, you have to constantly, like, go out to buy lunch or something. Especially when, after getting out from class, you're getting lunch from a cafeteria or from a store or a nearby restaurant. Um, when you're, when you're trying to take a break and you're using that break time for eating. Um... Usually in those times, it's like you barely have time for a home-cooked um, meal. But honestly, there's there's no there's nothing there's nothing like having a home-cooked meal. <laughs> uh, I guess John has been getting some screen time with the horse. He's getting screen time for the video, but mainly with the horse. Look at these two. Now John can ride with someone on the horse. That's pretty nice. Very dope indeed. Um, does anyone need to buy shit? Oh, wow. Hmm, not enough. That is a silver frying pan, what the fuck? That looks interesting. How about you, Chris? Oh, it's an ancient spear. Ooh, that looks sharp. Do we have money for any of these? Yeah, no, we don't. Well, this sucks. Um. Uh. Okay. All right, the original four. Well, sort of. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, never mind. Just a minute there. Who has a never ending thirst for fun and games? Only me, your friendly neighborhood quiz master. Can you tell who someone is just, just a mere glance? Then why not play Curtain Conundrum? Yeah, sure. Then let's get the show on the roll. I have three questions for you. Let's begin. Um, oh yeah, that's right. Uh, under a curtain. Yeah, that's... That was Todd. There we go. Of course. And that was Gerald. Of course. And the third person survey said... Ah, uh, you're getting too much screen time. <laughs> you're getting too much screen time there, Todd. Congratulations! You beat me fair and square! And we got th five HP bananas. That's very dope. See you later, Tice Sprite. Oh, nice. We went. We went the right way. That's very dope. 
I think we were supposed to come here. Very interesting. So this is the hamburger? I don't see any ham. Whatever, chow time. Yeah, it's chow time. All right. Let's beat this burger. If that's what it's supposed to be. More like a sandwich. Well, they call it a hamburger, okay. Hmm. We gotta get rid of those bread. Those slices of bread. nice. We're going good so far. As some of us here are kind of fragile. Especially Jiro. He's pretty fragile. Like glass cannon. Very nice. Damn it, Cairo! Alright. <laughs> At least I don't really get angry with guest characters, I guess. Wow, TJ, you're really brave. Very brave there, buddy. Uh... Oh, this is double slash. Okay. Okay, not bad. I meant jump slash, but okay. Oh, I keep forgetting that happens. Oh god, I keep forgetting that happens. Uh, uh. Spin him out. Give him back. Joe's in trouble, oh no. Poor Jiro, he's, he's literally stuck inside. Alright. Nice, that was a critical damage there. Nice charity. I learned to do charity. That's dope. These things can definitely help, like, especially during post game. Um, I know that this might not necessarily see much, but in post game, it's like, you know, yeah, these things, these, uh, these kinds of traits, uh, it's always best to have them be learned in advance before, like, post game. Hmm. Yeah, let's give it to John. Here we go. Who would have thought? We were almost hamburger meals. I should have gotten my hopes up. Well, best not to dwell on it. He 
Here, just a little thank you present. Why, thank you! By the way, do you know anything about Darker Lord KS? Hmm? Well, I know this person is dark and lordly. I can't tell you much else. Really sorry. It's okay, Cairo. I'm sure I'm sure we're gonna figure this out. Up. Oh. <laughs> okay. What's gonna be the screenshot of the day? <laughs> okay, you know what? Fuck it. Pleasure doing business with you. Showing a picture of Gerald, like, being devoured. Help me! Help me! <laughs> Oh shit, everyone is like, leveled up. Very nice indeed. These two are getting along just fine. Oh shit. Lots of people want stuff. Ooh, a golden spike gloves. Demon costume. Oh, a bouquet wand. Oh, that's pretty. That's really interesting. And then... Oh, God. I don't know what else to think there. Let's hand you that outfit. When I think about it, he hasn't really gotten that much outfit, if I do say so myself. Uh... Oh, glorious red. Glorious red. Hmm, okay. Okay, lots of people are really getting- are getting the hang of things. Okay. Mm. Mm. Yeah, here we go. Have a gotten gotten to have um Jack be in showcase yet. I wonder what's happening here. Okay. Oh, hey, uh, I'm trying to remember who exactly I did with that. Oh, here's Chris. That hamburger was a fearsome monster, but it did look kind of tasty. I'm trying to remember, did I necessarily, um... Oh, I believe this is... Yes, this is Ryu. Oh, yes, I remember. This is Ryu. This is good. Oh, the heart of it all. We've got to do something in quick. The abominable snowman is on a rampage in powered its peaks. And everyone's in danger. I want to do something to help them. But I don't think I can do anything by myself. Would you help me? We gotta, we gotta help Ryu out. Really? Oh, thank you! Alright, let's head out right away. It really fits it's the singing cleric. He's into music. Well, more so uh, making music. But I'm pretty sure it, it fits nonetheless. And now we're in this area. So, we have to eventually get to Power Peaks, which I think it's further into the, um... Which is further into this place. 
Look, John, it's completely white. The snow's so fluffy. Yeah, so light and soft. It's like a dream. It's great. It's a winter wonderland. <laughs> okay. Hey, we got some penguins. Nice little penguins. I think I remember like some of their later editions are like really beefy in terms with health. Fabulous. 